Today's DIY master session will focus on the return board microphone, a very small piece of equipment with interesting performance dynamics. Performance measurement is a very critical aspect of the game. Thus whenever the ball comes into contact with the bat, we need to know. In our case we also need to know when it hits the return board. So we achieve this by using a DIY microphone taken from an old set of earphones. The microphone is placed behind the return board. It is connected to a basic Android application which will record and store the audio. Analysis of the audio is then done on a computer. Our main focus will be on the longest spikes, which represent the moment when the ball hits the return board. The short spike that precedes the long spike represents the moment when the ball hits the bat. The idea is to measure how many times the ball hits the sweet spot. Oh, how sweet. In this case, we were paying attention to the number of impacts per second as a measure of consistency. There is loads of room for improvement. Don't you think? Let us know in the comments. The microphone is very sensitive to sounds in the surroundings, so this piece of equipment was used in a relatively quiet room. In some of the audios we could detect sounds of birds chirping outside. It sometimes compromises the quality of analysis. However, the graphical analysis gave us a clear picture of Rob's performance on the table. Click the subscribe button and enjoy some DIY masters sessions by Rombotech.